Hello, bearded bee people. Welcome back to B and K Bees. Lots of people have a lot of things to say about plastic frames, and I have a video on this specific subject called the plastic frame debate that I made a few years ago. I do want to make a couple of points uh, in addition to that video, so I'm going to make a video today uh, on essentially the same subject. Now, if you've watched this channel at all over the course of the last bunch of years, you'll realize that we've been migrating toward plastic frames. Um, we have not bought any wood frames for probably six years, five or six years, something like that. And the reason for that is, boy, plastic frames are easier. I mean, first of all, there's nothing to put together and nothing to break. There's not ever going to be a separation of the lower part of the frame from the top bar. There's never going to be uh, the breaking of, of your glue seal or the need to buy more glue or nails. And the problems that people usually cite when they are discussing why they don't like plastic frames are that they don't get drawn out as quickly as wooden frames. And I honestly don't, or don't understand that gripe at all. Um, first of all, obviously the thing that these bees are drawing out is the foundation. And in fact, the wax on the foundation. So I really think we should be discussing foundations against foundations as opposed to frames against frames. But either way, I will say very definitively, I assure you, we own thousands of wooden frames and thousands of plastic frames and we run them right next to each other in almost all of our hives. We don't have them organized in any specific way. There is absolutely no, what's that, just how it's yeah, perfect and mismatched half and, and half. Yeah, I've got a box that's like literally half, half and, and half, half over there. <laughs> <clears throat> so yeah, all of our boxes look like that. And there's no, there's no uh, advantage um, in terms of how quickly they're going to draw it out. There's just not. The real deciding factor, the thing that may or may not hasten or slow down the buildup of that frame is only the wax on the frame. Is there enough wax on that frame? If there is, then it is going to get drawn out as quickly as any other frame. And the other things that are going to decide as to how quickly it will get drawn out are the outside conditions. Are, is the nectar coming in? Are they in the portion of the year where they want to be building up into new areas? And do they have enough bees in that box to be warranting drawing out new combs? So use all of those things before you make your decision on whether you like or dislike plastic frames. But take it from me, it does not get any easier than buying a box of, how many are in those boxes, Katie? Yeah, 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 we buy buy them in boxes of like five or six boxes worth. So 50 or 60 frames a piece. They come double waxed. They're ready to go in the boxes and get drawn out right away. Uh, we just love them. And I honestly will never ever buy a wooden frame again. Uh, I have wooden frames that the the tips, the, uh, the edges here have broken. I have wooden frames that the bottom portion has broken free from the top portion and I have to continually shove it back together. I have wooden frames where the foundation has blown out of the wood in the extractor. None of those things are an issue if you're running plastic frames. They aren't more expensive, they're way easier, and the bees honestly don't care. So I know this is a short video, but I wanted to talk about that, get that out of the way. <laughs> I've seen a lot of recent discussions on this subject, so I thought it was a timely video to make. Thank you very much for watching. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment section below. I'd be happy to chat with you there. Otherwise, click subscribe so you get notified for other videos as they come out in the future. See ya.